what would need to be right in order to move back to the day? I think it'd be what would have to be wrong. Was San Diego? Happy Saturday, everybody. Ooh, it's a beautiful day in San Diego. The sun is finally out. And my plan today is have a perfect day in San Diego. A lot of y'all are really interested in what San Diego has to offer, especially, you know, ever since I moved from the Bay to here. And I feel like I haven't really shown off my city very much. A lot of my friends have like come visited from the Bay and they loved it. So I thought maybe I'd make a video about that today as a vlog. I love it here. I grew up here and I think just there's so many fun things to do. And I also am treating this as like a little treat and break for myself to take myself to my favorite parts of the city. So I've got this really cool ride today to use to go around San Diego. So thank you so much Hyundai for sponsoring today's video. I will tell you more about their new all electric Ionic 5 in a little bit. So far I've driven it and it's great. I really like it. So I'll tell you all about the features. So stick around for that. But first I am in Liberty Station in San Diego. This used to be like a Navy barracks and now it's turned into this whole like shopping experience with food and mostly food <laughs> and uh, I'm gonna go get coffee because it's 9 48 and I haven't had my coffee yet and there's uh, a really good coffee shop here so let's go coffee. I'm just walking around Liberty Station. I love this place. There's just so much stuff to do. It's really close to downtown San Diego. So if you're in the area and you're staying in downtown San Diego, it's kind of like the perfect spot to be. There's all these really nice like open green spaces where you're going to have a picnic. There's a whole Liberty Station public market where there's a bunch of different food places. I just got coffee at my favorite coffee place down here called Moniker General. They're shopping. There's just so much fun stuff to do. Like places like this were hard to come by when I was living in the Bay, but now it's so much easier. And it's just, it's free to just hang out here. So I love coming here and look at how nice the weather is. And people are just very kind. Now I am gonna go to my sister-in-law's house uh, meet up with Scott there and then we're gonna go for lunch. Oh, thank goodness for San Diego. I feel like just the amount of sun that I get here is like so different and it definitely helps with my mood and my health and my well-being. Really? Yeah. She knew. Bye, Bye, Carla. Bye, Carla. Hello. Baba, Baba. Say hello to my YouTube people. Ah. Nope. <laughs> yes. cool. I like this a lot. I like the cars come with this now. It's really like all the sounds are really gentle. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very Asian. Ooh, it does close. You found it. <laughs> wow. Wow. Scott has entered the chat. Yo. <laughs> Yo. What do you think? It's nice. It is nice. We're gonna go to lunch 
and then we'll kind of keep exploring, I suppose. Mm -hmm. I'm so sure I have to like pull this. Perfect day in San Diego with Scott. Comments. Had lunch? Oh, I didn't get a shot of the skyline. I'm gonna go get it real quick. Okay. Alright, you guys, we just finished dinner and we're right now in La Jolla. We're about to go to one of my favorite beaches in San Diego called Wind and Sea. It's just beautiful and gorgeous. Right now we're just like chilling. Um, it's actually right down the street from where Scott and I got married, the Darlington house, but this neighborhood is like so pretty. But I wanted to take a moment to thank the sponsor of this video, Hyundai. So Hyundai was super generous in letting me use this car today to get around town all across San Diego. And this is the all new electric Ionic 5. It's actually been really cool to drive this thing because it's not even out yet. And getting the first sneak peek at how this thing drives, like, dude, I've been driving this since like 9 a.m. this morning and it is a nice car. So I think y'all can probably relate that like when we think about the next car that we're gonna buy, it's probably gonna be electric because it's much better for the environment. And it's really exciting to see a lot more companies come out with new electric cars. And let me just say this one from Hyundai is like really like honestly so good. It's got so many IoT capabilities. It drives super well. The interior is really nice. I really like it. So I know that when it comes to electric cars, range is one of the main things that a lot of people think about. This car comes in both a rear wheel drive configuration as well as an all wheel drive one. The rear wheel drive one has 300 miles of range and then the all wheel drive option has 269 miles of range. That's basically like a full tank of gas on a regular sedan. So the thing about range and electric cars, things are getting so much better and this car really has everything to offer in terms of that. And when it comes to charging, this car charges super fast. You can get 60 miles of range in a five minute charge, or you can go from 10 to 80% battery in 18 minutes. As far as features and interior goes, I really like it as well. The cabin itself is super roomy. Of course, this window all the way at the top gives it that illusion as well, but there is actually more space because you're not putting an engine in here. Also, it has all of the safety features that you expect in a modern car and more. Things like forward collision avoidance assist, blind spot collision avoidance assist, lane keeping, rear occupant alert, driver attention warning, surround view monitor, and highway driving assist. And yes, it comes with Android Auto and Apple CarPlay and Bluetooth connectivity and like all the things that you would want to have a really nice car ride. Oh, not to mention the key for this car is an NFC card, or you can also use the mobile app to unlock the car. So yeah, very modern car, very like practical and seamless and elegant design. So I'll leave a link in the description box down below so you can check out and learn more about the Hyundai Ionic 5. And let me know in the comments down below who you'd want to take on a road trip with this car. Thank you so much to Hyundai for partnering with me on this video. It's been a blast to drive and it's been really fun to just like have this on my ride. It definitely makes my whole like perfect day in San Diego complete. What do you think about the car? Hi. Scott approved? Scott approved. Scott approved. Nice. Shall we go to the beach now? Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Ocean. It's the ocean. Congrats. It's so nice. It's like two weeks from Christmas. Yeah. And it's like so freaking sunny and warm. Clear skies today. Clear skies today. Look at that. Just nothing but gorgeous ocean. Italy, yeah, because we want ice cream before dinner. 
but we passed by this place, Landini's Pizzeria, which that's where we met Kona for the first time. Yeah. Because the rescue group that we got him from was doing a little like, what is it, like a charity event? And so we met Kona there, a little puppy. He was 10 weeks old. He was so cute. Salt and straw. Salt and straw? Should we get gelato or should we get salt and straw? I want salt and straw. You want salt and straw? We can get salt and straw. Let's get salt and straw then. Ice cream. Uh -huh. Was San Diego? No, no, no. With like my family or something. Oh. No. That would give me more out of necessity than desire. And more of your family. Like, we probably wouldn't move back there for work again. Even if we live, work for a Bay Area company, which you still do, I would fight to work remotely. But go to the office gym just like every once in a while. I think if I were single and I wanted to live in San Diego, I probably want to live here. In an urban place, I would not live here. Like, not very close to the beach. I finally got my ice cream out of under control. I took like four bites out of that thing. <laughs> anyway, we hope you enjoyed this perfect day in San Diego. I feel like San Diego, there's many different perfect days that you can spend. So if you'd like to see more of these, then leave a comment down below. But uh, hopefully, we did a good job of representing how great the city is and how fun it is to be here and how nice it is to come in December. So make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. If you have any questions about life in San Diego, let me know too. Anything you want to add? Yup. Yup. Okay. Bye everybody.